Yeah, found it first time that time. Ha 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 ha. You know what that's going to be doing my head in. Let's sort this out. Certainly not going to help if I need to make a quick exit. Oh, where was it? Is it Head should be in such pain by now. Oh, minimap glitch. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my god. I almost walked straight into that. Jeez. I don't want to even test it out. Can I see any diamonds? Uh, no. That looks like Nicolite, Redstone. I don't even want to hazard a guess as to what that is. No, no, no. Doesn't look like it. Look how big that patch of gravel is. Hmm. Got some gold there. All right. Well, I shall be right back, guys. Alright guys, I'm back. I obviously exited and came back. No more chunk lag. That was a uh, pot <laughs> potentially deadly. Head bonk, head bonk. if there's any diamonds hiding. What I normally like doing in um like when I'm just playing on my own, there's no one I'm not recording or anything like that. Is I normally just like going in a straight line until I find some lava. I don't even search it out if I hear it next to me. And you'll be surprised as to how often I actually find diamonds. I mean I actually find quite a lot. But um when I do find it a lava pit I generally dig on a three by a uh, three lane around it, but there's not much in this one. Although, having said that, how far down? I don't want to end up going into lava here. Yeah, I don't know how safe this could, this is. There we go. Look. Let's turn this bit into obsidian. Gives me a little bit more safety margin here. Dig this out, join up that room. How far away is it? There. Oh dear. Um, um, thank you. Let's dig up <laughs> and blocked off that lava there. Oh, it's that bit there. Oh, so this has actually come down a level. A couple of levels, in fact. I don't think we're actually going to dig around this, it's a bit too dangerous. Um, Yes, I'm being a chicken here, but it's not that great an area to be digging. The lava is constantly going to be changing levels, it's not worth dying over, really. Nothing's 
worth dying over, but... I hear zombies. I guess I could smell gas this morning when I woke up. And out on the streets as well. There's no gas leaks in our area. Turns out, there was, from what I gathered on online, there was a gas leak in France. And the winds just carried the smell over. So as I said to you, we're in a coastal town. And just the other side of our sea is France. What is that thing? What is it? A fire shard. Endermen are about. I tackled an enderman, it in was in my Simnew craft playthrough and I got whooped. I mean seriously whooped. I know there's a lot of stuff I could be picking up right now, but realistically I'm only after diamonds right now. Although this is always handy stuff to have. And I suppose I suppose the iron as well, though there will be a lot of that in the Twilight Forest as well. Here's skeletons. I'm really nervous hearing all these mobs. I don't like it when they just spring out at you. That's why I don't like the creepers. But not just the fact that they blow up. It's, it's the fact that they're, you know, there's nothing there, you've been really careful, you're, you know, you're going like this, every sound you hear, and then next thing you know, you hear the You know, this is... I know the creepers, and that's what they're designed to do, is to sneak up on you, but even so... It's just mad. So what level are we on? No. 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 It's the next one down we need. Oh, so that is lava, uh, diamond level roughly. Yeah. Right. Scary times now. Mobs around and we're digging around lava again. We are all set. Diamonds achievement get. Any more? There we are. And it's not coming for us, but we'll block it off anyway. Let's get out of here. And go to the Twilight Forest! Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I need to calm down. That is one of the good things about gravel. It's the sound it makes when anything walks on it. So it makes it like really easy to hear creepers. What am I doing? What am I doing? I completely forgot. Let's go. Let me do it on this ledge here. And we're home again. Yay. Now for the painful bit. Let's hope I don't get kicked off the edge. Toilet again. <laughs> Sorry. 
but I've drunk a lot of coffee today. Well, speaking of which, I think I'm going to go and make another one. I'll be back in just a moment, guys. Hey guys, I'm back. Sorry about that. Coffee's always good. Why well, I drink so much of it. Alright, pop some of this away. Take that with us. Diamonds can stay here. Take one bucket of water with us. Take this, gonna make ourselves a new axe. Um stick sticks, stick some sticks in this one. Yes. We're not gonna need to take any wood with us, there'll be plenty of wood there. It's called the Twilight Forest for a reason. <laughs> Here we're gonna need. No. I'll tell you what I do want to do though. Is that all the dirt there is? Mm -hmm. Ah, good. I want to build just a little safety net around the edge of this. No, don't all we don't always end up coming back to the same portal that we left at, but if we do then I want to make sure that I'm going to be safe when I come out do those corners afterwards if I've got enough so I don't want to have to come through and I'm going to be trying out the portal gun method of course, and if that works, then it will be so much easier. Okay, just enough. And yeah, get rid of that piece. Don't need that now. All right, let's do it. Twilight Forest. Twilight Forest achievement or Twilight arrival? I think that said. Yeah, I've forest. It's been a while since I've been in here. I can't remember how tough it is in this place. I think there were some places where it's really, really difficult, and some places when they were, and I forgot to bring iron. I wanted two pieces of iron to make some shears. Um, <coughs> there are obviously sheep here, and. I'm going to want to um, make a bed. So unlike in the um, nether, you're able to sleep in the twilight forest. Because I know when you when you try to sleep in the nether, it, the bed blows up on you. But in the twilight forest, it's always the same time of day in this place as well. And it's taking forever to load. Just, just as I reach for my coffee, what the hell? Um, ow, 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 ow. Right, going to pause it for a second to let it load in. It'll prevent frame rate. How's that doing? Mobs everywhere down there. Wow, got rubber trees in here. Awesome. Oh. Just in case we're not able to use the portal gun, let's make a waypoint. Portal. Now, what have we got? Sheep straight off the bat. I suppose we could always destroy them, but I want to see if this will work. I need a. Well, maybe I can do it on this. There. No. Okay. Twilight Hunter. Thank you. Just gonna load in as I get closer. Yeah, it's just a lot for it to load, especially with all the mods that are involved with this playthrough. Yeah, take that. 
I wonder, if I destroy this, will that portal remain? No. Ah, oh, man. That sucks. You can't uh, use the tree capade. Uh, well, well done me. Can't use the tree capade with uh, these type of axes. I did know that. Uh, excitement in getting here kind of removed that from my mind. Hmm. Right, I need to get a bed set up. Otherwise, if you if you end up dying and you haven't slept in a bed in this place, it will spawn you. It can spawn you miles away from anything. So that's useless to us. Do this now. Yes. Come on. Ah. Uh, thank you. Oh, it's that thing. I thought it was a creeper. You don't normally see too many mobs out in these open areas on this one, in this place. I'm just thank very, uh, very thankful for that. Apples. There's some oil. <laughs> Trying to see what we've got here. That looks like a hollow hill over there, which is what all the resources are. Look at that tree. Look, I've got some lapis up there. Hmm. All right, so we've got a broken house there with nothing in it, basically. Now over in that direction, see that big on top left got that big foresty area that looks like one of the dense forests that you're not really allowed to enter but I'm not entirely sure Let's go have a goosey the thing about these hollow hills um, um, yeah is there are a lot of mobs inside. Hmm. Is that a beehive in this place? Huh. Anyone home? Can you see those little black dot clusters just above my crosshair? That's a swarm of insects and they can hurt you fight them off like you would any other mob. I should have brought some wood actually. Just build my little cubby in. Little safe house. And I knew that was gonna happen. I don't know what the hell happened there. Um There are a few extra bosses in this place as well. Um, I mean, I, I I know the Twilight Forest from one of the other Minecrafters that I watch, uh, Meatwagon22, and uh, I think they went in, in the You Always Win playthroughs as well. But yeah, so I've seen. Let's see, what, what, what bosses have I seen? Um, the Twilight Lich. There's a Hydra, which is a three-headed dragon. And the more you... And if you kill one of its heads, like two or three more spawn in its place. Breeze fire, chucks fire charges at you. All those sorts of things. Um, there's Labyrinths. There's a... A Naga, which is kind of like this massive snake thing. It's quite an intense area in terms of bosses. 
Yeah, I know the wood's gonna mismatch and everything, but I really don't care. Just as long as we're safe. <laughs> 